time now to share with you our BT view of the day. And it does come from the north shore of the Diaz Vistas Trail in Belcara Regional Park uh, from the world of MW on Instagram. Thanks for that one. Gorgeous shot. Talk about a panoramic view there. Uh, did you happen to be uh, down in the lower mainland looking up at the mountains over the course of the weekend? You saw that fresh snow on top and the snow, it's fading fast from the forecast. That's not just for sea level right up to the top of the mountains. The freezing level is going to soar this week. So let's have a look at what's going on across the region. We did break some temperature records. I just kind of picked out a few of them. I counted 55 unofficial records over the course of the weekend. YVR yesterday was almost minus five. I mean, that broke a record going back, well, some, what, almost 70 years ago. Uh, Bit Meadows minus 0 0.4. Kamloops 11 below, smashing the old time mark, even Victoria. I mean, we had records across the island, central interior, northwest part of the province, southeast corner of the province, everywhere. We saw our temperatures running on the order of 10 degrees below average. And now there's a warm front lifting across the northern part of the province. There's still a little lobe of cold air trapped in the south, but it's also getting ushered farther inland. So there are some showers right now along the leading edge of this jet stream. You can pick them up on the Doppler radar as we zoom in on the island. But look at the last couple of hours. Those showers have moved to the south. They came through in the middle of the night. The temperature hovering pretty close to the freezing mark. There's a very slim risk of some patchy freezing drizzle for about the next hour, maybe hour and a half tops. The rest of the day, it's drier. It's milder, nine degrees. Look for some sunny breaks this afternoon and have a look at the long range forecast. There are no temperatures for the next several days and nights that go below zero. So we're getting back to normal. It's a little rain and drizzle tomorrow and again on Wednesday. I think Wednesday is the wetter of the two days up to 11 degrees by midweek. Thursday temporarily drying out Friday, the wettest and warmest one of this week. But that really doesn't clutter up your long range weekend forecast. It shows some promise for the trick or treaters. I think things dry out again on Saturday. Now, Thor, you're out with the kids on the weekend and you felt that <laughs> chill, didn't you? There's a rare Harris's Sparrow <laughs> at Terra Nova. So I'm like, girls, we got to go. We it's nine go. o'clock. <laughs> and they were not happy. Yeah, I had to take them to Boston Pizza to make up for oh, it. Oh, good cover. That's uh, I like that. Yeah, it was a cold one yeah. on the weekend and we're finally fading away from that now. So. All right.